Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video, I hope you're all well and um, before we get into today's video, if you could just quickly do us a favour and subscribe to the channel if you're not already and like the videos, if you do enjoy the content. Feels weird, like first day picking the camera back up after a day off, like one day, but it just feels like yesterday was not needed, but needed because of being drunk the previous day and being hungover on the Sunday, so guess needed is the right word. But yeah, I am feeling a lot better today than I was yesterday. Yesterday was absolutely horrific as someone that isn't normally hungover or gets hangovers. It was horrible and yeah, it just made us realise I don't like... Oh, sorry, my bad, I thought Kate was talking to me but she's on the phone. It just made us realise like how much... I don't understand how people can do it every week and I say this as a 24 year old like I'm going on like I'm so old but it just made us realise so much like wow like there's people that go out every weekend and feel like this every weekend and I'm like how do people do it there's not a chance I could do that and yeah so back from work oh, 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 oh I forgot I had these bad boys gonna have one now so yeah um yeah it just made us realize how much of like a waste like my diet just went in the bin um as you could probably expect but i'm gonna stay in the kitchen because katie's on the phone and i don't want to in here but yeah my diet just went in the bin ah damn kind of like i'm doing this at the minute anyways but yeah the diet just went in the bin oh look at this and um that's all i made us feel really down yesterday um because I'd done so well and then I knew like going back on the scales today it was going to be horrible and it was like I'm not going to lie about that like it was absolutely awful he says it's took me into a fruit winder it's got fruit in it so it must be good um and yeah I was just like oh man like really like having it but like you've got to have you've got to enjoy yourself so there's like that's one thing that I want to remember this time is just like still having times to enjoy myself and have a few days off the diet. Like I definitely want to keep going forward with that. Um, but yeah, I mean, apart from that, not a lot happened yesterday. As I said at the end of the last vlog, not not a lot really happened. Um, I'm just waiting for it to produce now, then I'm going to upload it. But apart from that, I hope you guys had a good weekend. And I'll catch us in a sec. Oh, right, everyone, I'm back from my grandparents as it's his birthday. Have I got another no, mark on my nose there? I'm um, just doing my dinner for the next couple of days because I didn't do it yesterday, obviously. <laughs> um, but yeah, just gonna have the fish, obviously, fish, sorry, rice, and the mixed veg. And then I'm just gonna do a pot of overnight oats for, well that's it on there. What about there? Yeah, that's perfect. For tomorrow. Um, and take it from there. This is another thing, like obviously with being hungover on Sunday, I'm just like, I always just feel, it's just like I'm just behind now <laughs> on everything. I've got a bloody punctured tire on me bike as well. I'm just, that's really weed us off. I'm just not in a not a, not not like I wouldn't say I'm not in a, like I'm in a bad mood. I'm just oh, just like typical. Then it will just be impaired, and I'm gonna have to spend I don't know how much on a nice new bike tire. Let's like say I'm fortunate that I'm in a position to be able to do it, and I'm grateful that I am, obviously. But I just like oh, just. So yeah, I'm gonna put the fish in, and then I, I honestly I don't even know what I'm gonna do for tea. Like I, it's times like this where it's just it's takeaway or nothing basically because it's just like Katie's not feeling too great, so she's just gonna have some toast, and it's like there's nothing else in that I want us like that isn't planned for the both of us. That's annoying. I don't want to not eat. Yeah. Oh, just so annoyed. 
To be honest, on the bright side, it might just get us back into running because I think I've asked for a lift to work tomorrow, but if I can't get a lift in, then I'm just gonna run in. I'm just gonna get up early and run into work. Um, because I'm not, I don't like relying on Katie taking us in all the time, especially when I do only live like 10 minutes away now. So yeah, she took us in this morning, bless her. She planned to sort of do her yoga and that when she got back, but she went back to bed. And to be honest, I don't blame her, <laughs> especially when the weather's like how it is. Um. So yeah, I'm just gonna do this and do some dishes. Probably just give you an update on food, which will probably be a takeaway. I'll see what Katie fancies if she's doing anything or if she's just having toast. Oh, but yeah, what? What? It's the bike and that's what's annoying is like when one thing goes wrong and it just seems like it ruins your day. It shouldn't ruin your day because it's just one little thing that's happened. But I think it's just the time as well. Obviously it's nearly half seven. I'm running around doing everything. Oh, just one of them days guys, one of them days. But we'll get there, we will get there. Um, if you haven't checked out the last video, remember to check that out. I haven't even, haven't even promoted it. Typical, typical me, yeah. But yeah, I'm gonna get get cracking. I'll probably show you just doing the dishes, and then catch up with you after that. Right, everyone, I forgot to actually record doing the dishes. There is some there just from the bait, but obviously. That will be doing later. Katie's just done doing her last day of yoga, which is great. Um, I have decided just to have something simple for tea tonight. I don't know what I'm gonna have. I, probably it's just some beans, something boring. We got some meatballs there, but I did use them. Yes, today or Saturday. So I think I'm gonna just have some beans. And to be honest, probably it's just that rice. Just with Katie not feeling too great and it getting on. Um, Nothing adventurous, we are going to order our next box of Just Eat tonight. And then going to look for a few bits and bobs. Like, this is where Huel would come in perfectly. I've obviously been listening to the Diary of a CEO. If you can't tell, because that is literally all he plugs is Huel and a couple of other things, obviously. But, sorry about this, my legs are going mad on the camera. Um, so, yeah, like, it would come perfectly for their nice, nutritious meals. If they want to sponsor us, you know, I'm here. <laughs> but no, I'm just joking. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna look into a few bits of the tire. I'm honestly dreading looking into the tires. Um, I'm in two minds whether just to get road tires as well for the summer, because that is something that I wanted to do. Just get some nice, sleek, slim tires. So I'm going really wee on the bike in the summer, but, oh yeah, nice boring night the night for the first vlog back right but yeah I'm gonna do that then I'll do my main actually I'll do that now I might actually record that as well I might as well just do that now while Katie's doing her yoga but I'm just gonna have overnight oats I think for tomorrow something nice and simple for tomorrow I am honestly so hungry but I'm gonna just get on with the night, have a good one. Back to the gym tomorrow. So like I say, if I'm running to work, obviously normally I would bike to the gym. So I might just have to jog slash do one to get to the gym. But yeah, I'm gonna sort bait out and sort bait out basically, because I was gonna say sort like the breakfast bit out, but I have it after. So yeah, I will catch us. In a sec. Right, everyone, that is Katie's yoga done and food done. Um, bait's all made up as well, so we're all nice and calm. Uh, we aren't actually going to get the HelloFresh this week. It was just another one of them things where we, we've come on, we've looked at the menu, and there's just nothing. Like, there's nothing there that we really fancy. Apart from if we had to pay. Yeah, apart from if we had to pay the bit extra, which sort of defeats the object at the minute, so... Yeah, we have just decided to skip this week again, unfortunately, which we are good about because we were quite excited just to get in the, like back in. Well, I think it 
really put us in like a good habit that the other week when we got it in terms of like I know it was just three meals but just cooking like prep like prepping all the stuff and eating healthy so I do think they they're really good for that benefit but I think there's just times where you look at the menu and there's just like there's nothing that you really fancy and or like there'll be one thing and it's like oh like a lot of this one was sort of risotto there was about three or four risotto dishes quite a lot of pasta dishes um and we were just like oh fish. yeah fish and but not if it was cod it would yeah. be fine but it's like hake so we yeah before. so we just give it a miss and we've put in <laughs> The next week's, which we are going to go for, a creamy chicken pasta bake, pork, chilli and rice burrito bowl and halloumi burger and wedges. So I'll show you them now on the screen because they do look really nice. So there they are in all of their glory. Um, re like Really excited for all three. To be honest, I think like we went with the burrito bowl because it's something that we wouldn't normally have, a halloumi burger looks just looks really nice and then the creamy chicken pasta bake good variety of how long they take as well 45 minutes 40 minutes and 20 minutes i'm assuming the pasta bake will be like because it just has to sit and bake in the oven really isn't it so yeah unfortunately no oh wow all over no um hello fresh this week but I've got one sort of question I think that I need to go through and then that'll probably just be the end of the video. I am sorry that it's not really been a good one. We have been a bit busy today. Um, not like busy but just like Katie's not really felt great. Then I got back, was in a bit of a bad mood about the bike and stuff. and Oh, it's just been, just felt like, oh, get us to bed sort of thing. So... Someone said, I like your videos, I subscribe to your channel, I'm also going to buy a new Gleason home. Can you please let me know the best design of the th of three bedroom house and also price with garage? Thank you so much. So, the price sort of ranges depending on where you live really, won't it? It's, it where you live, house type, yeah. where you're on, how far into the build you um, reserve. reserve. Like as in the site, because yeah. I was... <laughs> I'm not going to lie, the way that they're going at the minute, I won't be surprised if the last Kilkenny, we get about 15 to 20%, £20,000 yeah. profit on yeah, our house. On our house. Like, we gain because of the difference and the price yeah. is in The prices on this site especially just <clears throat> keep seeming to go up. They and go up, and up with every release, so yeah. it depends when you buy. Um, and like I say, oh. I think the biggest ones where you sort of live, if you live down south, oh yeah, you, the house that could it's cost gonna be grand here, here could we'll, cost you like... 150 or something down there so it just that just the prices it really to be honest you'll be able to find that out online depending on where you're looking so um and then the best design of three bedroom house we're obviously going to say the kilkenny because that's the one we've picked or the tyrone was the other one no, what's the other house type for this? Oh, it's Kilkenny uh, Wicklow. Wicklow, which is just that semi. means semi detached. Um, uh, but know, yeah, the other one we looked at was a Tyrone. We kind of like that one. And what's the one that next door have got? That that Kilda. is still nice. That the, the Kilda. <clears throat> that's very sought after. Yeah, a lot that's of like that's it. like you're very you look at it and it's like wow, like it's that fun. looks very yeah, it's a nice, nice it's, it's nice on the uh, externally and it's yeah. a lot of space upstairs. Yeah, that one we found was just, point yeah, because it's en suite as well, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, en suite, integrated garage, big, yeah. big, big bedrooms that are all quite good sizes. Yeah. And the bathroom, there's a lot of floor space, but the, so, the downside to the Kilda is the downstairs because you've got the integrated garage, which yeah. takes a lot of space. Your living room and your kitchen suffer a little bit and they're not... Just in terms of compared to the other like three builds, builds then yeah, three they're bed smaller. Builds. Like the living room and the kitchen are a lot. I would say like considerably smaller than yeah. what we've got. So again, that just depends on what you want. If you've got kids and it's like you're just going to spend time downstairs and your kids are going to be upstairs, then that might be the sort of house you want. I don't like. That's the thing is I can give my opinion on them and mm. and say obviously we've picked this house, so we think that's the best one for us it's not necessarily we don't mean it's oh it's the best one 
ever like this is the mm. only one you should go for it's or that we weren't considering others yeah that we weren't considering others because we were so I think Tyrone was definitely yeah. the favourite before we saw this one. Yeah, before we saw this one, it would have been the Tyrone. Gonna, we, we were very close probably to Probably would have got that one on the corner there. So, <laughs> yeah, it's just, like That's you say, it's... Oh, is it? The corner one's the Renmo. Oh. Tyrone's the one with the U-shaped kitchen. Oh, yes, yes, sorry, yeah. That's so, the one that's similar to this size was. Wouldn't so, you? yeah, it's sort of just... It, it's all just opinions, like I say, with the prices, you're better off just looking online or going to your local sort of Gleason. Yeah, yeah sales the office. sales office. So, yeah, again, I just want to sort of say thanks for the comment, and that will be the end of the video. So, I hope you have enjoyed. Again, sorry that it's not been too great. I think it's just with being busy. Tomorrow, there's all sorts that I want to do online. So, I'm going to hopefully finish work, get myself to the gym get back and get going and just get back feel like really it's just it's taken two days too long for us to just get back to normal like today has just felt like oh i've just been looking forward to get to bed and yeah i don't know i've just not felt great katie's not been very well so yeah like say if you say anyone else has any comments just get them in the comment section down below but apart from that guys i will catch you again remember to subscribe to the channel like the video if you did enjoy and i'll catch you tomorrow